What I tell you, that's him calling. What is this, amigo? What is this? Man, I just telling Terry, why to give Odell a call, see if he have as much fun as we are. Man, you sure know how to rub it in, don't you? Ain't no kind of way I'm having as much fun as you guys. Hell, I'm still in Mississippi. Now, brother, you know you could have come to Mexico with us, but now nah, you're afraid you might get homesick for them hoes. Nah, I wasn't for that damn jury duty. I'd be right there with Nosa, too. Plus, it's a black woman that's on trial for attempted murder for stabbing her husband. Oh, yeah, brother. It's a husband, black or white. I didn't know him, but her husband, black. Well, make sure that bitch goes to the gas chamber. I don't have a gas chamber no more. It's all lethal injection nowadays. Long as she ends up in a cemetery. I don't give a shit. Oh, yeah, before I forget, I overheard two black women at the courthouse today talking about Terry. Said they heard he went to Mexico. Say he's always broke, but yet he got money to go to Mexico. Yeah, they were mad. Brother with one of them bald headed. Yep, one of them was bald headed. The other one big and fat had on a weave, kept eating hot dogs. Yeah, brother, I know exactly who you're talking about, but yep, I'm sure gonna miss that big ass. All oh, these fine ass, beautiful and friendly mama cedars down here in Mexico, and you still worry about them big, fat, conniving, begging, bumming, bald headed, weave wearing, conniving bitches back in Mississippi. Nah, brother, these Mexican women down here are beautiful and friendly and don't be asking for no money, but. But they ain't got no ass. Damn, Larry, if I wouldn't have heard it for myself, I never would have believed it. Well, he ain't stopped drinking beer since he got here. It might be the beer. But if not, this motherfucker have lost his fucking mind.